chapter wise list of all my videos is available at this point for dvd pen drive please write an email to me these videos they do not require internet they play offline there is no problem of buffering and please subscribe to my channel for regular updates thank you thank you for your support once again let us take some more questions on lines and angles these questions are exam level questions so our first question is in triangle abc draw be this is called perpendicular this sign is perpendicular sign perpendicular to ac so first of all let us start by drawing a rectangle it triangle itself so a roughly drawn triangle a b c draw be perpendicular to ac this is ac this is b therefore a perpendicular drawn like this will create a point e here and this square means that this angle is 90 degrees and cf perpendicular to ab this is ab so r cf will be like this and it is perpendicular to ab which intersect at the point o this is the point of intersection let us label it as o if angle bac is 70 bac so let us label it as 70 degrees then angle boc is what boc so this is the angle that we have to find out let us call it x all these questions that i am taking are from the recent years papers of various competitive exams i have specifically selected the most complicated ones but some solutions are definitely very simple and this is one of the classic cases he says boc has to be found out i was able to observe that this is vertically opposite angle and therefore it should be x because vertically opposite angles are equal we discussed it in our lecture earlier so this is unknown this is 90 this is 90 this is 70 so if you can see then this is a four sided figure quadrilateral sum of interior angles of a quadrilateral is known to be 360 degrees just like we know that the sum of interior angles of a triangle is 180 degrees for a four sided figure it is 360 degrees this is a known geometrical fact now we will add the interior angles therefore x plus this 90 plus this 70 plus this 90 all four angles should add to 360 degree 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 and degree which implies x plus this is 160 and 160 plus 90 is 250 is equal to 360 degrees which implies x is equal to 360 minus 250 which is equal to 1110 degree if you observe a presence of mind is required after that no question which we have solved earlier and no question which we will solve later takes more than 30 seconds let us move to our next question now 
let O be the in center of a triangle ABC. First of all, what is in center? Let us know that this term is very well called and used in our exams these days. Definition of in center. In center is that point at which the bisectors of the interior angles of a triangle meet. For example, this is bisector for, let me say this is ABC. The bisector for this angle is this. Bisector for this angle is this. Bisector for the third angle will be like this. All the bisectors, they meet. So let me write bisectors of interior angles of a triangle meet I would say always meet in a common point which is called the in center. This is the definition of in center. So if this is one bisector, this is third, second, this is third. This bisects angle C, I'll draw two. So this helps me know that these two angles are equal. And he has said, let O be the in center. Therefore, this is O, this point. And D be a point on the side BC of triangle ABC such that OD is perpendicular to BC. Basically, I have to draw a perpendicular on this side. So, this angle is 90 and this angle is 90 and this point is D. If angle BOD is 15, B O D this is given to be 15 degrees. So I'll mark an arrow here so that you know. Then what is angle A B C? This entire angle. Let angle A B C be labeled as X degrees. Therefore, this angle will be x by 2. x by 2 degrees will be the angle ODB, OBD of triangle OBD. If this entire is x, then this portion is x by 2 because this is the bisector. Again, sum of angles of triangle OBD is x by 2 plus this is given to us as 15 plus this is 90 should be equal to 180 degrees which implies x by 2 should be 180 degrees minus 15 plus 90 taken to the other side which is equal to 180 minus 105 degrees which is equal to 75 degrees which implies x should be 75 into 2 equal to 150 degrees. So this is how we can solve this question which was looking tough. The only thing is you should be aware of the definition of in center 
and that the sum of interior angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. After that, it is plain mathematics, which is not a problem. This is crucial and this is crucial. Let us move to our next question of the same type. 